Welcome back, day seven of the cabin build. Today we're working on supplies. We have got 30, 30 or 32 tuba sixes that we have to take up the hill. They're 16 feet long and they are for our roof trusses or rafters, I don't know what you call them, but and then we've got some OSB board and some uh, block that we've got to get up there to uh, get started on the roof. We've uh, not been filming for a couple weeks, not been working on it for a couple weeks. We had a, a little family emergency with some sickness in our family and we had to take care of that. And But now we're back and going to be working on it. Hopefully in the next um, we got snow coming in tomorrow, so probably won't be any work, which we don't really like to work on Sunday anyways. But um, hopefully by next weekend we'll have the rafters up, I'm hoping, or whatever you call them. Trust rafters, not sure. But um, I hope you enjoy the video and I hope you have a blessed day. So we have to get this big stack on this four-wheeler up the hill. And you can see the cabin. If you'll look, it's at the main top. You can see it up there. I don't think it's picking up here. Yeah, you can see it. But yeah, quite a few trips up and down the hill. If you're wondering why there's no seat on the four-wheeler, our blue healers will not leave it alone. We have replaced it a good four times and each time they shred it. We have to do that um, 15 times up and down the hill. Unfortunately, this is the only way we can get the OSB board, the Advantech, and all that up here. This is the second option for a road to our property. Um, this actually used to be a road, but it is washed out. It's got, it needs a lot of help. These are big old trenches in it. But Keith will pack it up here on his back, and then he'll load it onto the four-wheeler and drive it on up to the property. He had to do this for all the Advantech. It was, imagine, what I imagine would be back breaking. I couldn't even pick it up, I tried. be stacking them under here because like that we do have about four or five days of wet weather coming in so we're gonna stack them in the dry hopefully it won't be long I think time 
we get longer days, I think in four weeks from now. So we'll be able to work in the evenings. Matt will help us so much. But I'm gonna get all these stacked. Okay, so here I'm just showing you that I, we got all the tube of six stacked in the dry, and we also end up putting a tarp over it. And now we are working on the ridge beam. We took a 16 foot tube of six and a 10 foot tube of six. In the middle, we done the OSB board, and then another 16 foot tube of six and 10 foot tube of six to make it, and it was really heavy. Um, I also wanted to go over how much we have invested in this so far. We ended up having to spend um, another like 700, I've got the receipt, but I think it was like $760. So that put us to right around 20, I think we're right at 27, $2,800 in it so far. I really don't think that's bad at all. But um, yeah, we're getting this done. We did not get a whole lot well, it took a long time to get all those supplies up the hill, so we didn't get a whole lot of actual work done. But we did get the ridge beam built, and we set it on top. Um, next, it'll be lifting it six foot in that six feet in the air. But I want to thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a blessed day.